This is one of my favorite times of the year. That's Paul Daly, the arts director at Ivy Tech's John Waldron Art Center. He's talking about March, Youth Art Month. Waldron's high school gallery opening is Friday where students get to display their work in a professional setting. This is exciting for us. We love having the student artwork in our building. He says this month gives students a chance to learn professionalism in the art industry. So they get the chance to come in, uh, see where they're going to hang their art, figure out the process for curating it, and then they get to come in with their families on opening night for the galleries. But some student artists won't be seeing their work on Friday. This is uh, something similar to what was taken. Last weekend, someone broke into the gallery through a window, stealing seven pieces of 3D artwork. Take a look. This police photo shows the suspect. Bloomington police describe him as a thin white male in his mid-20s with dark hair and a beard. Captain Joe Qualter says the suspect probably came in through a window. I think, actually, this is a real testament to the artwork that was done that somebody would think it was valuable enough to take. The student artists agreed to talk on camera, but can't meet until a later date because of weather conflicts. Police are searching for the suspect and stolen goods. The gallery opening is free and open to the public on Friday from 5 to 8, and a full description of the stolen items can be found on iustv.com. In Bloomington, I'm Molly Jurasek, Hoosier News Source.